Today we are looking at sentence 88, which is found on page 99 of your book. And the sentence is, the waves crashed, at night the wind gave us chills. Let's start with the parts of speech. We have adjective, noun, verb, preposition, noun, adjective, noun, verb, pronoun, and noun, okay? Let's repeat this. Adjective, noun, verb. Preposition, noun, adjective. Noun, verb, pronoun, noun. Now let's look at the parts of sentence. Waves is our subject, and crashed is an action verb, and it does not have a direct object, okay? We also have wind as a subject. Gave is another action verb. And let's look for a direct object this time. The wind gave what? The wind gave chills. So chills is our direct object. And if we look between our verb gave and our direct object chills, we see the pronoun us in between, which means we have an indirect object, okay? We only have one small prepositional phrase, which is at night. And as for our clauses, the waves crashed is an independent clause. At night, the wind gave us chills is another independent clause. Two independent clauses make a compound sentence. Our punctuation is a period, so that means it's either declarative or imperative, and this is giving us information, so it is declarative. So it's a compound declarative sentence. Notice that this compound sentence was joined with a semicolon instead of a coordinating conjunction.